Hey everyone, Kiwi King 77 here from the AC Syndicate team here to do a video reviewing the stock Android 4.1 Jelly Bean ROM on your Nexus S4G. Got a lot of people asking me um, how progress is going for Jelly Bean on the Nexus S4G. It's going okay. Um, it still has a decent amount of bugs, so I'm not going to go ahead and do an install video. I'll do a how to install video once it's more stable and more of a daily driver, but let's go ahead and jump into it. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on the device. It will have that uh, stock Jelly Bean boot animation. Again, this is a ROM, so you will need to have a custom recovery to install it. I will link to the ROM. Uh, if you do want to try it out, I'll be going over what works and what doesn't at the moment. Today is the 12th of July, so this is progress as of then. But there you have it, that nice stock Jelly Bean boot animation. All right, so I went ahead and booted up. Let's go ahead and first of all go into settings. When we go into settings, we're gonna go to about phone and under about phone, you will see model number right there, Nexus S4G, Android version 4.1. So we are on Jelly Bean. Quickly tap on the Android version and it will bring up a nice uh, hidden Easter egg there. Uh, press and hold on this guy and it will get some floating jelly beans which you can kind of push around, flick around in space. So there you go, you can have fun with that little Easter egg and flick those jelly beans around. So <laughs> uh, anyways, um, let's go ahead and run through this ROM. So as I said, it is Android 4.1 jelly bean, what works and what doesn't. So I'll just say what doesn't work, you guys can take it from there. Uh, well, 4G does not work, so no WiMAX. Uh, 3G is going to work. Obviously Wi-Fi works as well as I am on Wi-Fi at the moment. Uh, face unlock does not work, uh, stock MMS does not work, so you're going to need to use a third party application for messaging in such as GoSMS, so you can use that if you want to try this out, and I believe uh, GPS does not work either. So those are the main things that really don't work at the moment. Uh, other than that though, as I said, 3G Wi-Fi is going to work, calls are going to work, obviously texts are going to work if you use that GoSMS application. Anyways, you have a different lock screen where, of course, you have unlock and camera still, but you have a shortcut to Google Now, uh, which I'll get to in a second. So you can go straight to your camera application if you want to open that up, which is going to open up there. So you can take pictures, of course. That works. You'll see you've got that new camera application from Jelly Bean. Uh, you can actually, if you're taking a picture, and let's say I take this picture, you can actually swipe from the side here and it'll go through your pictures that you just took. So that's kind of neat. And then uh, you can obviously scroll back and forth between the camera application and your pictures. So that's a nice new feature with the Jelly Bean camera application. I do have a full review of Jelly Bean. I guess I can link to that in the description if you want to check that. I go over pretty much every feature in depth as well. Uh, but uh, other than that though, uh, you can press and hold on the home button and it will get you your recent running apps list right here. Uh, of course, you can swipe those away. Um, app drawer wise, you have Google Currents. Um, it is pre-rooted. You'll see you have Super User there as well. Google Wallet, I believe that should work as well still. Uh, but yeah, so uh, there you have it there. Um, again, I don't think you have a shortcut to get into the Google Now application. Uh, it looks like search button is going to take you into Google Now. You can press and hold on that, uh, that search button and it will actually open up Google Now. What's the weather like in Chicago, Illinois? It's 30 degrees and cloudy in Chicago. Here's the forecast for the next few days. All right, there you go. So 30 degrees, which is completely wrong. Apparently it must be in Celsius, so you have to change those settings. Uh, but yeah, uh, anyways, that would be uh, how to sh quickly get into Google Now. Press and hold on that, uh, that search button and you can do that. Or you can use the lock screen, go up to Google and there you go, you can have your search or tap on that. Uh, so yeah, I mean, that works great. As you saw, it brought up the weather right away. You'll have to mess with those settings so you're not dealing with Celsius and you, if, if you, unless you use Celsius, obviously. Uh, other than that though, I mean, opening applications should be very smooth. Uh, you got that Project Butter going on, which should, which should work well. So you'll, you'll see when I open up different applications, it pops them open from where I uh, basically open the application and they seem to be very smooth. Transitions seem to be pretty quick. Obviously this is a Nexus S4G, so um, it's not really gonna be as smooth as a Galaxy Nexus, but uh, I mean overall though, it seems to be running pretty smooth, not, not too much lag whatsoever. Uh, obviously that new 
notification pull down bar, uh, which mm. where you get notifications, you can actually pinch on them with your two fingers and expand or contract them. Overall though, that's really about it. So I wanted to cover, um, just kind of cover what was working and what wasn't, give you guys a quick overview just because a lot of people have been asking me, is there a full port yet? Not yet, not full, uh, but I mean, basically everything does work. So if you want to try that out, I will link to the thread. Otherwise though, I uh, be sure to subscribe as I will be doing updated videos for the Nexus S 4G coming up here uh, shortly. Hopefully uh, we get um, more of a working port going. But other than that though, that's just about it. So be sure to subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Plus. All links will be in the description of the video below. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.